Hello everyone, and I know this is usually not the way I do a video, but we're expecting some difficulties in our room, so our light blew out, so I really can't turn on the light, and I won't have that beautiful light I had anymore to make those beautiful adjustments and flashes, but it's all good. Can't complain. As you can see, we got the dollhouse, our Barbie dream house in the back of us, because yes, we... You know, still play with dolls. As you know, our, our YouTube channel name is WWE Topics and Doll Topics. And I'm sorry that I look like shit right now. But you know the vibes. And the vibes are hard. So, yeah. And right now I have my daughter with me, Denise, who just turned a month old oh, not that long ago. And she's just taking a nap. So, Denise is leaving. So, I'm just going to put her... Put her down for a nap because she's asleep. And then I'm going to start this review for my one of my custom purses. Okay, so here we go. I was going to, I was debating on if I should put this on my IG as well, but I'll probably make a post that I'm making this video. And I'll probably try to do a live where I'm showing this again, too. But if not, you'll just be able to watch it on YouTube where it should forever be there. Regardless of viewing. Because I don't do nothing for views. I do it because I fucking want to, okay? So, the packaging has been opened. Because, of course, I opened it to see what it looked like for myself. Because, bitch, duh. But some people wait to view stuff when they get in front of the audience. But I like to view it myself first sometimes depending on if i plan this but i thought this pocketbook's so nice bitch do a review so comes in this plastic from lauren lash a very bougie uptight name like myself and she has lauren lash designs.com for her website so i guess she makes stuff like this so i'll probably go on there and check out some more of her stuff and, um, of course, my information, which I'm only going to show for a second, because I don't need nobody coming to our crib. Now, even though the packaging of the, um, thing is nice, uh, this is just the generic white box. As you can see, that's the bottom, and this is the top, and open from here. Now, I believe the purse had some other plastic on it that was like a film that was holding it because it's, it's just plain clear. But I took that off so it keeps it from getting scratched or anything, which is also a plus. So, in the interior of the box, um, well, you can't really see, so I'll just go like this. But the interior of the box, you see nothing but... The purse and the inside, and there's no pamphlet, no certificate, no certificate of authentic, no certificate of authenticity. Sometimes it's hard to say that with a mouthful, and it's just the purse. No like thank you note or no like receipt, none of that. Cause some people do that. So the purse is wrapped in bubble wrap, and originally this is how it came, and bubble wrap just like this. And I'm pretty sure you've seen this style of purse before. The purse, this is the purse's original style. But my word is custom on it. So as you know, every time I change my hair, I go by Pat Acapella. Because one of my favorite rappers is Duke Acapella, Little Duke. Even though he's not an all-time rapper, so you guys probably don't know him like that. Or at all. But yeah, he's on my uh, Instagram page. And you can check him out on YouTube and other stuff. And the letters are carved into it, which feel really nice. I didn't touch it before. I didn't want my fingerprints all over it. Now, you see how clear this bag is. You can see my whole entire face to it. And this is the size of the bag, which is pretty genuine for the taste. I think the bags that look like this that I'm remembering are a little bit smaller. You can see inside the purse, and you see it came with this in the inside. And it's a chain, which are supposed to clamp here so you can put the purse together gold frame and at first i couldn't figure out you don't pull you just slightly um you push this yeah you push supposed to push something yeah you push this i think 
forgot how I did it. Oh, this. Okay, so you pull this this part back. Pull that back, and it opens. And you can see this is what holds it together as a purse. This clear lining. And this was already inside. This is the chain for the pocketbook, and it comes in this little plastic. And you just open it. And you clamp it. So I'm only going to, guess, clamp one side. It's kind of hard because I got on fake nails, acrylic gel nails, whatever. All right, so I got it out. Sorry. Um... actually really hard to do with fake nails but I need these things to come on okay well I can't do it because of my nails but this is the length of the string the string is really long and it fits stuff inside of it I haven't put anything inside of it yet but yeah it fits stuff inside of it, so even though I haven't put nothing inside of it, let me just look for something real quick that big enough that an average woman would have in her purse, so that way, you know, you could just go about it, be about it, and be on your way. So I'm just looking for something to show y'all real quick, so just in case, you know. All right, I don't know if this will fit, but I got this spray, this Summer's Eve right here, baby powder, because I love the scent of it. And women can't actually use baby powder because of ovarian cancer. But it makes you smell nice, especially on your menstruational cycle. So I'm just showing you, like, say, like, you got to go to work in the morning or something, you want something to carry. Just something a woman would have in her purse. So I'm just trying to see if this fits. And it does, it appears. Close it up. And see, you got your summer's eve. So just something, it fits pretty decent stuff. It can't fit a whole lot, but it can fit enough. So, yeah. When I do put stuff inside of it, I will probably show a video of that. Yeah, and that was my Twilight Saga, Jasper doll. He just fell. Um, so, yeah. But, um, you know, I'll show you guys how I pack my stuff. But, uh, yeah. See you in the next one, and thank you. This was my review for my custom Acatella um, purse um, made by Lauren Lash. And see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.